Hello, how's it going today? And this is Frankie Nelson here. I've got to say, what a great series I just watched now. I'm like three episodes in and I'm hooked. I think it's only got two seasons into it. I'm not quite sure if the site has anything downloaded it and stuff. I'm not even sure. But it's it's called Intelligence. And it's a great show. It's kind of like NCIS, but a bit more technological. And a bit more of a better storyline. It's about this guy that has a microchip in his, like, I think, his brain or something like that. Which allows him to actually, you know, um, get information out, like a computer, basically. And he's working with the government in order to help him fight crime. So you could say it's like NCS and, you know, CSI, but a bit more of a better, you know, advanced version of it. And there's a lot of recognisable characters in there. Like, obviously, I haven't seen the um, character has got a chip in his brain. His name is Gabriel. And his protector is Riley. That's basically, like, he's like property, basically, for the government. And you got and you got another um I forgot the person's name is she's got like red red hair different colour hair basically and she she acted in CSI. I don't know if it was Grissom and the other actors in there. I can't I don't know who her actual name is. But there's some great episodes in there. I mean there's scenes in these episodes where you had to like find a you know, find a bomb, like a terrorist type of bomb, you had to fight somebody for it. Then you had to fight off some, you know, other like soldiers and stuff like that. You know, in this episode I just watched now, he had to actually basically find someone that was from episode one of season one because uh, he had like another, you know, basically someone that had another chip in their head was getting into his and that interfering with it and, you know, was controlling him and stuff like that and they dealt with it at the end. It's an incredible show. The action's good. It's better than the, any other, you know, crime drama type action they see. I'm going to put up the crime drama a little bit too, but... I've got to say the quality, the graphics is not an like altered carbon. Altered carbon and this one is a bit more different. Altered carbon was, is more like a different kind where they've got sleeves and different people are using the sleeves but the same identity of that person. This one's just about a guy with a microchip in his brain where he, I think his brain was neck and he has like crime stuff. It's a really good show. Storyline's brilliant. The action is good and pacey. I love it. Um, I wish I could, I was, I'm, I'm going to watch a bit more tomorrow. It's a must watch. Literally, I was looking everywhere for an action movie or series, right, to watch. And none of them, not many of them sounded good. The Beekeeper is what I'm planning to watch. Repeater is what I'm going to be planning to watch. But I'm glad I found this one. Because this one, this one, the ones that appealed and stood out to me. Because see, series and compared to movies is very different. It's difficult to find even good movies out there. But series, it's good to find a good action series. I struggle with that, like, the same if I found a horror series, it's tough to find some. And this one here, I'm glad I found it. Whoever took part in making this movie, thank you for making something. It's my sort of movie, some of a chip in their brain or neck or whatever, and they're like, they're like a computer. It's like a, you know, superhuman computer, if you want to put it that way. The scenes in it is brilliant. I mean, even the acting is phenomenal, right there. It's just incredible, actually. Um, it's a must watch. Um, this obviously will be a short video than usual. I don't want to go through every single detail so I'm ranting on. But let me think, the rating I give this is a 10 out of 10. I think this is another flawless action, but well, another flawless series, but with good action in it. I just don't, I think there's nothing wrong with this at all. I can't see anything so far. I know I should watch like a whole season of it, but there's like a taste of what I've watched so far. To sort of you can watch your face up and what you think. Some of you may not like it, some of you might do. But this is a classic, you know, action, you know, crime type drama series, if you want to put it that way. Better than the other type of crime drama I've ever seen. There's more fighting in it, more in, more intensity with the action as well. Not as good as Altered Carbon, I must say, but still the same rating. I think Altered Carbon, I give it 10. Everything about it is just phenomenal. The acting is brilliant. I've got I've got to tell you though the acting is from what this is is fluent. Like they do they know how to play their part, they do it so calmly. I know it took a lot of takes, but to do that is great. It's only like what, forty minutes each episode. So it's great. I've been trying to look for something short like that. Instead of looking for an hour one, you know, and I'm glad I looked for it. You know, if you enjoyed this video, please give a like, comment, share everyone know, subscribe and hit the notification below. And I shall see you in my next video.